Hey guys, I just realized I never showed you the rest of the fan installation. Okay, now this is what it's going to look like when you get it. You'll get it in a kit, and you're going to take it up. This is one I've already had together. But what you do is you take the kit, and then you change it. This used to be up here and stuff. And you just take it all apart, so it looks like that. Okay, then your end result will look like this. See, there's that little bracket. This bracket comes, this comes assembled, and the fans clear out to here, which doesn't sit over the motor, which is silly for this kind of fan setup. So you just take it apart, rebuild it so it looks like that. And then you saw the cutting. And this is what the final product looks like. See, it's all tied into the ESC. And see that? And it never gets hot. We've ran this thing. This is like, I've lost track on how many we've done now. But everything we have rear drive has this. So this is the final. And God, I just realized I didn't have that on there. Sorry about that. This is our Rustler project with the Grape Ape Morph into, which we'll be bringing back Grape Ape, but just not as fast. This was a $50 roller we got, and we've replaced the front uh, front and rear shocks. Those are Fox shocks. It's got a KV-47, I mean a KV-57 Sidewinder 2. Uh, as you can see, and we've got the, can't see that, but there you go. Let me see if I can get that in there. That's a, it's a Sabox. WO231 or something like that, I can't remember. And, uh, but I'll tell you what, that thing screams. We blew the transmission right out of it because it was a first gen, one of those double clutch ones. And, uh, all plastic gears, which we knew it was going to blow. But then we took the one off the Grape Ape, the Stampede, and uh, there it is, guys, final product. This thing, we don't know how fast it goes because it just goes fast. But you can run it all day long. We take it trail riding all day, big, long trail runs, and this engine doesn't even get that hot at all. This fan is just a dream. See? Check it out. It kind of creates a little... I don't know if you can see that in there, but... Looks like it's got a little bit of a cyclone thing, so it kind of blows it out and kind of forces the hot air out. It's really super cool, dudes. But anyways, this is the final result of the 30-plus rear stampede rustler slash bandit fan installation. So if you like it, like, subscribe, and uh, hope this works for you because it sure has worked for us. All right. Everything RC's out.